What do you want to be when you grow up? Uh, I don't know yet. Drug dealer. <laughs> All right, Tavion, how old are you? 17, finna be 18, August 24th. So what high school you go to? Uh, I'm uh, taking my GED right now. I got put out of high school. Yeah, what, what you get put out of high school, if you, if you don't mind me asking, what you get put out for? Uh, fighting, fighting. Do you want to go to college? Time to time, I think about it. Yeah, then no. Oh, no, I don't think it's for me. I wanted to go to Rankin. Straight out of high school, I went to Rankin. And uh, I went up there, but I never did the placement test or whatever. So at the Rankin, I think I uh, started working. And then from there, I just been working. So like on and off work. So pretty much you feel like you was given opportunities. Yeah, you just didn't yeah, really. I didn't take the opportunity yet. I get, I got an opportunity, but I just didn't take it. So. Oh, you want to say something? Oh, no. <laughs> okay, how old are you? 17. Okay, and what school do you go to? I go to, uh, I'm taking GD classes right now. And do you plan to go to college? Oh, yeah. I got to go to this basketball, my dream. I'm going to pursue it. What college are you trying to go to Missouri? Yeah, that's where I'm going. That's my, that's my St. Louis. So what's your plans after, you know, completing GD school? Are you planning to go to college? you planning to get a job? What's going on? I, I'll probably go to the Air Force for real, or the military. I'm trying to be flying over instead of shooting. Ain't my cup of tea right there. What college you go to? St. Thomas Aquinas College in New York. It's my senior. It's gonna be my senior year. If you did want to go to college, do you think you you have the opportunity to do it? Yeah. Why? Cause I'm strong-minded. I like to fight for success. So with that being said. I work hard to get where I'm at. So I graduated from high school and I want to graduate from college. Who do you think was like your biggest motivation to go to college? Myself. And why? Because I wanted something more. Because high school sucked for me. So I was just like, well, it's got to be something better in college. So. Was there anyone that like inspired you or like was like a huge motivation in your life to 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 want to do that? My mother. What about her inspired you? Her getting on my head basically like her, you know, getting on my head, getting at me. Do your work, do your homework so that way you could be successful. Who do you think would like help you get to college? My grandma. Why? How would she help you? Because like when she like when I was little, she used to always like she'd be ghetto sometimes. That way I understand better to do. Like she'd yell at me and stuff, like cursing and stuff. But it'd be like in a good type of way, not no bad type of way. So do you have like a role model then? My dad. And why? Because it's like everything that he see, everything he was doing, he don't want me to do because he see I'm going in that type of path. So he been a big part of my life because he sit down and talks to me before I do wrong. He just, he, he like, he been there, him and my mom, but I'm going to say my dad my role model. Are you in touch with, like, your parents and stuff? And uh, I, stay, I stay with my mama. You know, she cool. I don't, I don't talk to my daddy for real. So who do you think in your life has provided you, like, the most opportunity to just achieve, to just grab your, grab your goals? My baby mom. Because it's like she, like, she been there for me day one. She, I love her. She had my daughter most of all, and I got I I got to do this for my daughter. It's not because my baby mom. I mean, it's a part. Is she a part of it? But I feel like my daughter is the most important thing in my life right now, and I got to take care of her. So I'm gonna do what I have to do. What part of St. Louis did you grow up? I on the north, south, east, and west. Then what high school did you go to? I went to Sodan, huh? Even in the Annie Malone uh, marching uh, uh, parade, we always had the best band going on. Come on now, let's give it for the Sodan Tigers. Sodan. <laughs> Opportunity-wise, do you feel like that the school system provides you with different opportunity? How do you think the school system is? How do you think it's helping you to become the person that you need to be? I mean, it's... It got its pros and cons. I mean, it's helped me by, you know, when I get in there, they keep me focused. But then, you know, outside of that school, you know, everybody can't walk you down the street, make sure you're on the right path. So, you know, kind of flip side to it. 
out the army, you know, I went into a manufacturing. And it was, back then, it was some great jobs in St. Louis, you know. And if you lose one, you know, there was another one right around the corner. The job's ability is not there in St. Louis at this present point, you know. But uh, everything, and uh, I see all the businessmen trying to do things to uh, bring all the business back in St. Louis, you know. And I appreciate that. But right now, the temp jobs is what's going on, minimum wage. Like you tried to get a job, but you didn't get it, and you think it's because of... Any any problem like age, race, like occupation or anything? Like no, nah, because any job I want, I mean like I'ma go for it, but I'm not out here looking for any job. I want a job that I can have and it set me for life. Like I'm going to school for construction. Yeah, I'm going to school for I'm going to school for brick laying. I'm, me and my brother gonna go out and build our own house.